little back blade on here and um, I need to uh, plow the driveway because uh, FedEx refuses to come in my driveway. I don't get it because it's not that bad, but I think they just don't want to, uh, they, they don't want to drive in the snow. It makes their route quicker if they can find a refusal. So. And uh, drain the bowl. The sediment bowl is pretty clear, so we're all set here. Let's see what we can get going. I like to hold this about, just hold it about 30 seconds. Uh, these glow plugs are just like in your standard, well, my Ford Power Stroke. 7-3 power stroke at them. Okay, it should be long enough. <laughs> Warm enough to run, let's get to plowing some snow.
there you have it folks it's not the neatest job i've done but this is access to our barn where we keep our horses so we have a little atv we go in there with we back it out and we just kind of go out that way into the hay field and then around this way i drive around that way myself so i don't really care and we have a nice walking path here so let's go up this way and take a look real quick look here on my tractor the uh, tractor has no chains i got a set of chains i'll probably throw on there and i got to check the fluid in the rear axle because the hydraulics were acting a little funny and i think it's just fluid so we'll see how that goes okay we'll move on so this is all good so our piggy toes don't get snow covered I have to shovel off our little deck here, but we have access. That's our that's our main entrance to our home right there. Somebody wants to go in the house, so we'll move around this way. And this is our little trailer. You saw the other one in the video, but we keep this here so we have access to it. Uh, with horses, you never know what's gonna happen. You wanna have access all the time. So we made this nice and smooth to drive on. Um, I guess it's about 20, so. The ground finally is frozen. It's not gonna go away. The biggest thing is the mouth of the driveway because the town plows the snow into the mouth and it's gotta be cleared out. So we can walk out here. Now would I recommend this to anybody? No, don't do it. But like I say, we've had this, we've had this for 50 years in the family, so much i do have another option here that i'm going to use i have a challenger side by side it's a utv i'm going to switch that over i've got a snow plow that i got off a lawnmower garden tractor whatever you call it i'm going to make that snow plow work on that economy is a thing i i have a job i make money i spend money no reason to spend it where you don't have to if don't mind doing things a little different now you know, long term, yeah, it would be nice to just go buy a cheap plow truck, whatever, whatever. But this is a this is the way I do it. So, thanks for watching, folks.